<laughs> yeah, man, let's get to these. Let's get to these hornier slash down bad responses, okay? All right, Lloyd, shut the fuck up. I guess. One time I caught my... Mm, you know what? I'm not going to read these out loud. I'm not going to read these out loud. Don't call me lazy. Ugh. One time I caught my sister masturbating after I saw her I joined her. Let's just say that was the best day of my life. Oh my goodness, bro. That's like, bro, Jill, what the fuck is wrong with you? And you said that shit with some fucking confidence too. Like, what? What? What are you, like, what? You got it, man. Chill, bro. One, nah, I'm not, for now, I'm not reading nothing. I said, I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna do this and do this. Do this and do this and let it play. Once beat to a VTuber cuz I was bored. Once beat to a VTuber cuz I was bored. You did that cuz you was bored? Like, straight, just you, you saw a VTuber and said, I'm about to beat to this shit. I'm bored, so let me beat to this shit. Like, that's what you said? Out of boredom? That's what you did out of boredom. You did that out of boredom. One time I was so horny I started fucking the middle of the couch and nutted all into pillow to this day nobody know. But the couch. The couch but the couch that ended up getting pregnant with two two pillow cushions. You feel me? But the couch, the couch that you violated, that you have to sit on every day and feels and it feels the type of way. That couch, that couch could never could never feel any better. That couch you have to sit on that couch that's sweaty Stinky, sticky, nasty couch. Come on, bro. Actually, do better, bro. We all have had down bad moments, bro. But the middle of the couch, you're violating a couch, my nigga. An inanimate object. And you see why women say they'd rather be in the forest with a bear. You are the, like, I, we, see, look, as men, we try to tell them, like, bro, we're not, we're not like that. But they just think it's like you, like you, that give us a bad rep. Like, come on, bro. Like, come on, bro. What are you doing with your life? Do something better. When I was eight years old, my dog was feeding himself. From that day on, I was ghosts are real. Here's my story. What? Wait. What? Is it like the next part of your story? Don't call me lazy, bro. When I was eight years old, I heard moaning sounds from my mom's room while my dad on a business trip. From that point on, I was trying to prove ghosts are real. Here's my story. Who is this nigga? Stop telling me what your story is. Okay. Okay, I'm getting a little too lazy. Should I just read them? I'm getting a little too lazy. When I was eight years old, I heard moaning sounds from my mom's room while my dad on a business trip. From that point on, I was trying to prove ghosts are real. Here's my story. Wait. I, nigga, I thought I was tripping. Okay, I'm about to just read them. What if they short? One time I broke my leg, I had to go to this. One time I broke my leg, I had to go to the hospital and stay at the night. The nurse came in and she had a fat ass. I smacked it and she gave me sloppy toppy. She's my wife. You're cap. You're so cap. That never happened. On the niggas, that never happened. On the niggas, I'm actually, I know that never happened. Or, you feel me? That never happened. There's no way a nurse, a nurse is that horny that you broke your leg and you slapped her ass and she gave you top without getting caught. Come on, bro. That didn't happen. Top five things have never happened. Sure, buddy. That happened. How do I tell my best friend I love him? We've been friends for seven years. Please tell me what to do. Ethan. Wait, so you're a boy and you're in love with your boy best friend? I I don't know what to tell you, bro. I, I have no advice on that. Like, honestly, 
You feel me? It's different because who knows? Like, unless your unless you're, is your boy best friend also gay? You feel me? If he's also gay, then it's different. Like, you can obviously go, but like, how would you like? Like, I you feel me? I don't know how you go about that as a gay person to another gay person. Feel me? I mean, to a straight person. It's like, cause if he's straight, then you might just have to chalk that shit up. Cause like he he's straight. Like, you feel me? He's straight. But if he, if you're both gay, then just go for it. Like, you feel me? Type shit. That's not really a horny or down bad moment. So, like, keep that shit out of here, though. You should have put that in a normal confessions I had two days ago, and I would have gave you better advice. I touched a little kid, try to guess who I am. Um, that's definitely uh, Jaden. Yeah, that's Jaden. Um, Jaden, don't matter. We're going to find you. SpongeBob touched me at a festival. I'm not gonna lie, I got touched by Buzz Lightyear before at um, Disneyland. Not Disneyland. Uh, it was like I like a um, it was like a music park though. They had what's it called? They had uh, they had Buzz Lightyear. They had all the Toy Story people in one area, and we was there. And when I like we was taking pictures as like a group, cause we took a field trip, and Buzz Lightyear caught the feel of my ass cheek, and I was like eight years old. You feel me? It'd be like that though. Sometimes that shit happen. I don't have any. I'm too perfect. I'm banning you. Appreciate the subscription, months. I was bored. I beat to Lloyd while you were reading this. I'm beating to you right now. Ending the stream. Y'all, y'all gonna be the death of me. Faji, I once finished up to six times, finished up to six times in a single day. It hurt like hell. My dad almost caught me once. Six times? Were you like aiming for a record or something, buddy? Like, are you good? Six times? Six times? The most a person can get out of me is three times. And that's like pushing the limit. That's like me going, like going beyond my limits. Like fucking, what's that shit? What's that shit? I gotta go beyond. Push me on my limits. You feel me? Like, on some fucking My Hero or Academia type shit. I edge to big black men like Louis. First of all, you don't know what I do in my spare time. Second of all, you you not gonna throw, you do what you want to do in your spare time. You ain't got to feel me. <clears throat> One time I fucked my stepmom, got her pregnant, but she aborted the baby, and we don't talk about it till this day. Cap. 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 I call cap. I call cap. Nah, Lloyd, how big is it? Alright, bro. That's how you end it? That's how you end it? How big it is? You wanna know how big it is? That's how big it is. Damn, two more? Alright, you know I'm beating to you. I use my mom's vibrator to make me nut, but I clean it. So you put it in your cheeks? You put it in your cheeks? All right, bro. Y'all told me to start off with that? Y'all freaky as hell.